I, I always thought it would be the banks that would do something about digital identity. I mean, without a shred of evidence, I just assumed they'd want to. Um, years ago, I was on the, the Joint Tech UK Apex, what was then called Financial Services Passport Working Group, uh, which was actually a good idea. You know, the idea was to have something a bit like the sort of Scandinavian bank ID, but well, with a more sophisticated infrastructure, so you could do selective disclosure and things like that. Um, None of this ever happened. I still have to open bank accounts by using, you know, me holding up a picture of my passport and posting copies of gas bills and whatever. And now in the space of a week, I see Apple is going to enable, you know, using iPhones to validate driving license and things from other iPhones. You know, this the stuff I presented years ago about why symmetric digital identity is very different from digitized identity. And I also see Plaid are launching their sort of you know, ID once, use anywhere platform as well. It's like the banks have decided they just don't want any of that value. And maybe it's for the best, maybe big tech and tech fins can just do it better.